All right, I want to show how to open a Mini Cooper uh, hood when the relief lever inside breaks. And there are several videos on this online, but they all do it from the from the viewpoint of the latch inside the car. I thought I'd do one. I had to. I screwed up my latch. I had to buy a new one. So I thought this would be a good opportunity to show exactly what you have to do, what you're dealing with. So the, uh, if you look from the bottom, okay, you'll see it like, it looks like this. All right, and so it's hard to tell what the hell it is uh, from looking at the bottom. So you need to have an idea of what it looks like from this point of view to see how to get it to work. And the object of the opening it is to get this junction here, this locking mechanism back so that this can pop open and it'll open. Now, a, it's very easy to dislocate the spring and have it come loose. And I, I, if you can, you can do it without it, but if you can leave that spring on there, I think it'll work a little bit better. So the, the driver's side, which is on the left side of the vehicle, if you're sitting in it, uh, it's, it's fairly easy because you can actually see this this uh, mechanism here, which has the little ball from the uh, cables in it. And it's not that hard to reach in with a, a, a flathead screwdriver and literally just push here and it opens. Boom, it's open. Now let me try to close this again. So that one's fairly easy. All right, now it's reset. Now, how to get this one? Well, if you go from if you go from un underneath, what you can actually do, and we use two hands here, is you can actually put something in here and watch. If you just pry, it's going to open. Boom! It doesn't take a you know just uh, something uh, a, a, a flathead screwdriver. And to be honest with you, you can almost reach up in there to get to that point. But what you're trying to do, let me reset this again. Okay. You're trying to get into this little groove between here and here. This little groove right here. And you're going to try to just apply some torque and pry the side back okay you can actually just see how it just slid in there and it and it opened up watch i'm going to put it back the so watch if i just take a, this and just slide it in there okay and with a little torque it's going to open up boom it's done one more time reset all right let me hold it so that it doesn't go out of focus again so I'm just going to slide this up in here and just use this, this piece as leverage and it's, it's going to open up. So I hope you, this helps a little bit to understand how the lock works. And if you can just work on prying this piece back using this as a fulcrum it, or just by pushing on this one on the left side or using it as a fulcrum here, you can open this fairly easily. All right.